Aquatoxin. There are, what, I think three or four studies now that show that there's a mold toxin called Aquatoxin A that is high in, that um, if you expose rats to Aquatoxin A, it will kill off their dopamine neurons and uh, create this clinical syndrome that looks a lot like Parkinson's disease. I think one study even showed that, that rodents with Aquatoxin induced symptoms of dopamine deficiency responded well to L-DOPA. So you would think the next logical step would be to go running to patients with Parkinson's and ask, are, do they have higher levels of Aquatoxin? That's the reason we just sacrificed these rats, was to find out if Aquatoxin could be responsible for hurting dopaminergic neurons. And the scientists concluded yes. There was a huge link between aquatoxin exposure and loss of dopamine neurons. Why has nobody in the Parkinson's community run with the idea of testing people with Parkinson's for aquatoxin?